Um, right now, uh, that's kind of what we're teetering on in terms of is he or is he not. And uh, we're, we're going to know more today. Zach Lytton was banged up a lot last year and he kind of struggled to come back from injuries. What, what does it mean for him to come out and kind of seize the starting job? It's been great. Zach has had a great camp. He's probably one of the guys that have had the best first month of practice. Um, it might be the first time in, since I've been here that for one whole month he hasn't been dinged up or banged up, you know, and, and I think that that plays a huge part in uh, how productive he's been. But right now he's healthy and he's playing really well. So it's good to see him, you know, at that point. What are your expectations for Sean Kitchens, one of your freshmen who's on your depth chart? I forgot you mentioned some of his preseason. You know, I've been really proud of him, Mark, uh, you know, in a lot of ways. You know, he's been a, he's been a guy that's made some really, really nice catches for us in practice. He's worked really hard. I think he's big and athletic where he can help you a lot uh, on your special teams units. Uh, and he's getting better at his blocking. And, you know, we need him to be able to block the perimeter. We need to be able to use him some in the box as a blocker. You know, you kind of mentioned that he was with Eric Smith in there. So, you know, uh, he's a guy that can do a number of different things. He can be a, uh, a blocker on the perimeter, a blocker inside. You can put him out there a wide out. He can catch the football. So he brings a lot of dimensions to the table. And um, so it'll be, it'll be fun watching him play, you know, his first game. How about with Eric Phillips? Is he going to be ready to go for that opener? No, no, he's not. Do you have kind of a, an idea in your head how you want this game to go? Obviously, I know, I know you want to, everybody wants to win, but do you have like a, a something in your head that says, well, I want to, by the third quarter, I want to have some of these guys in, get them some experience, maybe replace, you know, get Cam out, get your number two quarterback in, your, you know, see guys play. Well, I think you always have a plan. I, you know, obviously, I, I don't want to be presumptuous enough to feel like we're going to be able to play, you know, second team guys or whatnot. I mean, this is, you know, you, Arkansas State right now, just so that we're all on the same page right now, has has done some some really uh, some really good things in the past when it comes to playing the Iowa's of the world, like they did last year. Uh, Texas a couple years ago that, you know, they took Texas down to the wire. I mean, this head coach, Coach Roberts, has been there nine years. And, um, you know, defensively, they're always one or two in the league, uh, probably the last three or four years, um, you know, in, in their conference. Um, you know, they got a new offense that's, that's fast tempo. It's, it's, it's very similar to ours in that regard uh, with a new offensive coordinator. So, you know, hey, we're going out and trying to win. Now, if we ever get to the point where something happens where we're able to play young guys, then obviously we'll have a plan. And But let me backtrack on that because we've got a plan right now during the game to play young guys, you know, in the middle of the game, no matter what the situation is, because we have to. So, you know, we've got a good plan on what, what we want to do. I, I don't really have any kind of pregame thought on how you know, I have an idea of how it's going to unfold. I mean, I know how I'd like for it to unfold, but this is going to be a tough football game for us. It's going to be new, and we're playing a lot of young guys, and it's going to be fast-paced. And uh, Arkansas State's not going to come in here and, and be wild by any of this. It's not like they haven't played, you know, all over the country. So this is going to be a tough game for us, and it's going to be a good opening game for a lot of our uh, young guys that have never played before. But it's going to be a tough game. Gene, this freshman class came in with a lot of credentials, and there are 10 true freshmen on the depth chart. Can you uh, just talk about the great camp they had as a class? I think, you know, it was kind of what everybody expected. It was a, it was a uh, you know, it was a camp where those young guys got opportunities, for one. You know, sometimes you get young guys in, they don't get a lot of opportunities, but this was a camp of opportunity for all our young guys. I think that was one of the reasons that, you know, attracted him to Auburn. So uh, it was good to see him come in and, and be able to have a chance to compete. And then when they had that opportunity, you know, they ran with it. So that's why you're, you know, you're seeing, you know, that many people on the depth charts. And there's more because there's more guys right now that are going to be, you know, in roles that may be just special teams. 
And so, um, you know, as I said before, you know, there's going to be a good bit of young names out there that you just got to get used to. Well, obviously, you know, two games that fast is a concern. And, you know, certainly going to Mississippi State uh, is a concern. And, but, you know, right now we're focused on this game. And uh, it'll be a fast turnaround. We know that. We've prepared for that. But, you know, we're not looking ahead to, you know, game two, game four, game six. I mean, we, we've, got to, we've got to go out and win this football game. I think he's handling it well. I don't think he probably really gives it a whole lot of consideration. You know, every day he's just out there trying to get himself better and trying to make our football team better. So I don't know that he pays a whole lot of attention to that. Uh, I know that he's a, he's a very competitive player, so he puts pressure on himself to be very good. And uh, so I don't know how much the other really plays into that.